Good afternoon, everyone. Shri Garg, other members of SEBI, a very warm welcome this afternoon. World Investor Week is a week-long global campaign promoted by IOSCO and in India coordinated by SEBI to raise awareness about the importance of investor education and protection and highlight the various initiatives of securities regulators in these two critical areas. From the past few years, NSE has been actively participating in the World Investor Week, and this year, too, NSE will actively participate in the World Investor Week 2021 from 22nd to 28th of November. To mark this occasion of World Investor Week, NSE has organized Ring the Closing Bell Ceremony today, and a very warm welcome to all of you all for that. India has come a long way from an agrarian economy in the early 40s to a major technological and financial hub of the 21st century and an emerging global power. Today we are the world's sixth largest economy in terms of nominal GDP and the third largest economy in terms of purchasing power parity. It is also one of the youngest and fastest growing economies in the world. Notwithstanding the pandemic, the last few months have seen a strong economic recovery attesting to the resilient nature of the economy with GDP growth this year estimated to be 9.2%. The development of the economy and financial markets are interdependent. India's financial markets have undergone rapid expansion over the years in terms of valuation and participation. In the last 25 years, the number of companies listed on NSE has grown nearly 5x. And in the process, the overall market capitalization of NSE listed companies has risen by more than 65 times and the average daily turnover in NSE's cash segment alone has risen by more than 250 times. During this period, NSE has added 50 million unique registered investors and 89 million trading accounts, which is a remarkable milestone, not only for NSE, but for India and the capital markets. The digital revolution ushered by NSE has paved the way for advanced and emerging technologies such as artificial intelligence, machine learning, blockchain, et cetera, and financial markets that have the potential to drive business innovation, transformation, and client engagement over the next decade. In 27 years, NSE has successfully emerged as an institution of national importance, with leadership positions across multiple asset classes, not only in India, but across the world. NSE is the largest derivatives exchange in the world in terms of the number of contracts traded, and the fourth largest in cash equities by the number of contracts traded, which is a matter of great pride for a young institution like ours. Over the years, NSE has built robust, fully integrated business model comprising exchange listing, trading services, clearing and settlement services, indices, market data feeds, technology solutions, and financial educational offerings. NSE offers a single stop, wide bouquet of financial products and services delivered through world-class technologies that cater to the needs of different types of investors and businesses and contribute to the overall economic and market development. In our commitment towards holistic and sustainable economic development, NSE has also taken several initiatives that address environmental and social issues through our interventions in green power generation, energy conservation, water conservation, waste management, and social development. NSE Foundation, the CSR arm of NSE Group, has undertaken several projects that are focused on primary education, elder care, sanitation, and safe drinking water, health and nutrition, environment sustainability, and skill development. We engage actively with the stakeholder groups and discuss key business issues pertaining to the environment, social and governance dimensions of our business, which has helped us in achieving our sustainable goals year after year. The Indian financial markets have witnessed strong retail flows in the last two years. While significant progress has been made in the last 27 years, our journey is far from over. The penetration in capital markets remains relatively low when compared to traditional savings instruments such as gold and bank deposits. We are committed to working along with the regulators and policymakers to further enhance investor participation in capital markets. Traditionally, metropolitan cities have been the major contributors to the capital markets. However, an increasing number of investors, particularly from tier two, tier three cities and beyond, have been actively contributing to India's growth story as reflected in the shifts in investment choices towards mutual funds and capital market instruments. One of the major reasons behind this change can be attributed to improving investor awareness by enhanced availability of information through digital media and growing awareness amongst general public about newer financial asset classes apart from conventional fixed deposits and such other savings avenues. The trend of more and more investors coming into the capital markets either directly or through indirect routes such as mutual funds 
augurs well for efficient capital allocation, supporting strong economic growth of the country. NSE has an elaborate investor education and awareness program across 600 plus districts that includes over 4,000 programs conducted throughout the year and partnerships that deliver digital programs to achieve scale. We have been actively conducting various investor awareness programs through on the ground IAPs and now through webinars with varied target audiences such as general public defense, police, professionals, government and corporate employees, gram panchayat and Bachat, bachat Guts, small scale entrepreneurs, women, self help, self help groups, and educational institutions. Such initiatives have contributed significantly to improving retail participation in India over the years. NSE is committed towards building trust and integrity in financial markets by investing in technology and regulatory initiatives that reinforce risk management, streamline compliance requirements, and protect investor interests. NSE's focus has been to promote initiatives which are beneficial to the economy, markets, and investors. As India progresses towards becoming a self-reliant nation, we all need to strive towards building the right environment and infrastructure conducive for long-term sustainable growth and development. We recognize our responsibility to help India achieve its aspirations and take its rightful place amongst the world's leading economies. Thank you very much.